Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I am Rajnikanth and today's video will gonna discuss a quick difference between at the rate mock and at the rate inject mocks, right? So if you have not subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe it immediately and hit the bell icon to get all the notification, right? So ultimately you will be get benefited. Okay, so uh, let me start quickly. So already I have a project where I have used that inject mocks and at the rate mock. So let me explain you, right? So at the rate inject mock and at the rate mock, those are two annotation belongs to from Mockito framework, right? So whenever you are going for an interview, if that project follows test driven development and agile things, then definitely you'll get a question. What is the difference between at the rate inject mocks and at the rate mock, right? So here at the rate mock, what it will do? It will create the mock object, right? So here user DAO, I have annotated with user DAO. So what exactly it will do? It will create the object as a mock, right? It will create the mock objects. Now coming to add the rate inject mocks. So add the rate inject mocks, what exactly it will do? It will create the object, real object. It will, it will create the real object. Suppose here you can see on user service, on user service, I have annotated at the red inject mocks, right? So here it will create the object of user service first. So the real object it will create, then whatever those dependencies are there in that object, it will inject those mocks, right? So the dependent objects are mocks, right? So let me explain you clearly. So uh, these annotations are already I told these are those are from Mockito. So while doing the unit test cases, suppose you want to unit test case user service, right? So for user service, you need you want that real object, right? To call those methods and to execute those methods, we want the real object, right? So that time at the red inject mock, what it will do? It will create the object of user service, right? and whatever those dependencies objects are there right so here you can see for user service user dao is the dependent object right so here we are doing auto wild so user dao is the dependent objects so the inject mock what it will do first it will create the object of user service then it will inject these mocks right so here you can see dao is the mock so this mock will be injected to this one, right? This mock will be injected to user DAO. So user DAO object here is that mock object, right? So whenever you are calling this service class, so it will execute as user, right? Service dot get user ID by name, right? So it will execute here. It will come to here. It will print the system dot out dot print ln, and here we are calling user DAO dot get user id right so but as we are using mockito and here user DAO is that uh, what is what is that mock object right so while calling this user DAO dot get user id it will not call the actual method so if you see here the control will not go to here right because it's a mock object so that behavior we need to tell so how we are telling so when DAO dot that mock object dot get user ID and we are passing this parameter, then return this value, right? So whenever in the flow, so service dot get user ID by name, we are calling here. This line will be executed, and whenever user DAO dot get user ID by name, it will call. Then this value will be returned, right? As this is a mock we are defining that behavior so what exactly will happen whenever we are calling that method right so that the real code will not be executed of the mock right so mock objects real code will not execute right so this is the basic difference what is the difference between at that mock and at that inject mocks right hope you got that idea so uh, this is a basic unit testing things how to do unit testing if you don't know what is unit testing and how to do 
that unit testing already i have uploaded a video for the mockito things so i will give that uh, details in the description section you can watch those videos as well right so hope uh, you got a uh, clear idea the basic difference so if you got a clear idea you can uh, I, I want i just need your feedbacks in the comment section right so thank you for watching